headed down there to see what's going on. We heard the word drowning, and when you hear that, you start start going with a bit of urgency after that. Tonight, three local teenagers are being credited with saving two lives after they drown in Lake Coeur d'Alene. Good evening, I'm Stephanie Vigil. Those teens were at the beach Tuesday afternoon when they heard some commotion near the dock and with their quick action, saved two lives. Sending things over now to our North Idaho reporter, John Webb, who spoke with one of the teenagers today and joins us with their story. Very heroic, John. Yeah, it certainly is, Steph. And thanks to those boys, the two men who drowned are doing well tonight. I, I don't think I'm a hero. Um, I think I think we just did what anybody else would have done, um, especially all of us at the beach crew. We have a great team here at the beach crew. They're all awesome. All of us would have done the same thing. Lane Stidham, a 19-year-old North Idaho college student and one some are calling a hero, was at the beach Tuesday afternoon when he heard some commotion near the dock. We headed down there to see what was going on. We heard the word drowning, and when you hear that, you start start going with a bit of urgency after that. Stidham grabbed a preserver and ran down to the dock. And we saw one person on the dock and they already starting to begin uh, CPR on that person. As they were performing CPR, they were alerted of another man unconscious at the bottom of the lake. Another teenage boy jumped in and pulled the man above the surface. Drag him up onto the, onto the dock. And at that time, we started doing CPR. As they continued with CPR, switching from person to person, Stidham had a sense of hope. It was nice to see life. That would give, gave me more hope on the guy I was still performing CPR on, that this guy could still be saved. Hope that turned into a miracle. That man regained consciousness, and both of the men were transported to Kootenai Health in Coeur d'Alene. It's, it's quite unnerving, but um, as far as like the CPR goes and the reviving, you kind of just keep going no matter how hopeless it seems. In the PIO at Kootenai Health, and she says that one of the men who drowned was treated and released, and the other is in good condition tonight. Live on Lake Coeur John Webb, KHQ Local News.